North Korea's high-profile nuclear weapons program has captured international attention in recent years, prompting concerns over the possibility of nuclear warfare with the United States and other nations. But aside from its prominent nuclear weapons program, Kim Jong-un's hermit kingdom potentially has another arsenal up its sleeve in the form of a biological weapons program. A new report from Harvard think tank the Balfour Center released this month said it's highly likely the nation is building a stockpile of biological weapons. Using intelligence reports and the testimony of defectors from the country, the report mapped out 13 potential agents that North Korea is assumed to have in its possession, including cholera, anthrax, the plague, typhoid, and other such pathogens. In addition to possessing these agents, the Ministry of National Defense assessed that North Korea may even have the capabilities to weaponize them, the report stated. A reasonable assessment is that North Korea has the capability to cultivate and produce biological weapons. Interest in North Korea's potential biological weapons program was aroused after Kim Jong un's estranged half brother was reportedly killed in February using a state manufactured, deadly nerve poison known as VX nerve agent. Kim Jong Nam died at Malaysia's Kuala Lumpur International Airport after two women seemingly attacked him with the deadly poison, revealed by a Malaysian autopsy. North Korean officials subsequently denied those allegations and said the man died of a heart attack.